Hello, good evening, everyone. Good evening, teacher. Hey, Luis, good, good evening. Hello, good evening. Welcome to the class. Good evening. How are you tonight? Good evening, Very teacher. Very hot, teacher. Very hot. Yes, you're yes. right. It is very hot, right? I'm in Chalate. Ah, okay. It's so yeah. hot. Is it hot in Chalate, Nango? Yes. Very, very hot. So now you can imagine how is the weather in the other, the other departments in El Salvador. Um, Usulután. San, San Michael. Usulután. It's the same. No, it's probably the same. 30, 30, 36, 37 degrees. degrees. Yeah. Okay. So welcome to the class. It's a pleasure to be with you tonight. Thank you very much for your quality. Thank you. You are doing a great job during this course. So I have a question for you. Uh, what about the platform? Uh, have you already started working on the platform? Tell me. I started the I started the, the, the platform. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah. Does everyone has a problem? Does everyone have a problem working on the platform? Yeah. Have I, you I, I have a problem and uh and the part uh, 2.11 listening exercise daily routine because don't uh, um don't repeat the 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 speaker is ah, okay. is off okay. I don't know what happened can you please tell me again the number of the exercise? And we're going to check it right the now. The number 2.11. Oh, you are in section number two. Two, yes. Okay. 2.11. 2.11. Just give me a second. This is section number two. Yes. How you spend your day? And you are working on section. Two, this is the record. 211, let me see, 29, 210, 211. This part, this exercise. Yes, this is. When I want to play uh, the star, don't. Oh, it doesn't work. I can it doesn't see. work. Yes. You are right, it doesn't work. Okay, let's try something. Let's click on this icon and we're going to see if it's work in this. Listen to Rodney, Tina, and Ellen talk about their daily schedules. Complete the chart. Can you listen now? What do you do, Rodney? I'm a chef. Yes. Yes. yes? Then yes. we can try this, right? If the audio doesn't work, doesn't work in this part, just click on this icon, and uh, this window is going okay. to display, right? And, okay. And here you can Thank you. click on play, and you are going listen to listen to Rodney, Tina, and Ellen talk about their daily schedules. Complete yes. the chart. What do you do, Rodney? So, so you can do that, Luis. Any other question? Any other problem with the platform exercises? No. Everyone can, ac can access to this. Ya todos probaron su usuario, su contraseña, que pueden resolver los ejercicios. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes? Yes. Okay, yeah. very good. So remember, right, that you have to be working on this, right? You have to complete the five section of this platform. And if you can start right now, please, uh, it's very good, right? So keep working on this, keep working on this. Don't forget about this, right? But we are still in section number one. And yesterday we were studying, who remember yesterday topic? 
What was yesterday's topic? Do you remember it? WH question would be. WH question would be. Yes. The example. Of what you conversation. Made. The conversation. Ah, okay. I will learn yesterday how to introduce ourselves. Right? How to introduce ourselves or how to introduce yourself. Right? Como presentarnos nosotros mismos. And we, uh, we practice. Uh, now I need a volunteer who wants to try tonight, just to see if you remember yesterday's topic. Any volunteer? I am the volunteer. Okay, thank you, Luis. Can you please start? Hello, everyone. Good evening. My name is Luis Urias. I'm from to El Salvador, and I am 56 years old nice to meet you okay perfect luis that was excellent thank you very much now luis choose one of your classmates choose one of your classmates just tell me his or her name um oscar okay thank Hi. you huh. Hello, Oscar. Oh, hello. Estoy teniendo problemas de, con la conexión. Se me corta. No escucho muy bien. Oh, okay, very good. Thank you. Thank you very much. I understand. No problem. So, any volunteer? Any volunteer to practice how to introduce yourself to a group of Me people? Me, teacher. Thank Alejandra. You, Thank you, Alejandra. Hello, good evening. I am Alejandra Rivas. I am from El Salvador. I am 26 years old. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Alejandra. That was excellent. Thank you. Choose one of your classmates, please, Alejandra. Choose one of your classmates. Okay. Um, Andrea Mariel. Andrea. Okay, Andrea Mariel, can you please? Yes, teacher. Thank you. So introduce yourself to the class, please, Andrea. Okay, hello, good evening. My name is Mariel, but please call me Mari. Okay, please call me. We studied that phrase yesterday. Very good. The last one, the last volunteer, the last volunteer tonight. Me, teacher, Carmen. For this part. Who say me? Margarita? Okay. Hello, good evening. Uh, my name is Margarita Medina. Can, please call me Margarita. I am from El Salvador. I am. First 49 years old. Nice to meet you. Okay, that was excellent. Thank you very much, Margarita. Anyone? Anyone want to participate in this part of the class? Nobody? Any other volunteer? Thank you, Carmen. Thank you, Carmen Diaz. Hello, good evening. My name is Carmen Diaz. I am from El Salvador. I'm 44 old. Nice to meet you. Okay, thank you. Just the phrase, I am 44, right? I am 44 years old. I am 44 years old. Okay, I am 44 years old. Okay, now that is perfect. Thank you thank very much. You. Thank you. Very good try. Thank you, Carmen, and thank you guys for your participation in this part. So that is what we studied yesterday. In tonight's topic, we are going to study this. Uh, this is the second topic, information question. Information question with B. So let's start with this. Let me know if you can see my screen. Yes, teacher. Yes. Yes. Okay, just a second. I 
I can see it right now. So it's a review of yesterday class, right? What, what are the WH word equation? Do you remember? What question? What's your name? And the first. Okay, very good. So here we go. Welcome to the to your class number two, information question. And also today we're going to study yes, no question, but let's start with this, right? Uh, what? What is the meaning of what? What? Que. Que. Okay. 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 Now, can you give me an example using what in a question? What's your name? Okay, that's it. What's your favorite color? Okay, what is your favorite color? What is your name? What is what your about favorite name? Okay, what is your favorite food, etc. Now let's see where. What is the meaning of where? Where are you from? Can you please give me an example using where are you from? Okay, that is a good example too. Thank you. Where are you from? Where are you from? Now we have who. What is the meaning Bien. of who is he? Who is she? Very good. Now, when? What is the meaning of when? Cuando. 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 Can you give an example using when in a question? When is your birthday? When are your born? When is your birthday? You... Okay, that's excellent. When is your birthday? Perfect. When is your birthday? You say, my birthday is on January 31st. Uh, why? What is the meaning of why? Porque. 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 Can you give me an example using why? An example. Why you don't remember? Okay, why don't you remember? Well, that could be, right? Uh, for example, why are you angry? Why are you sad? Why are you studying English? So why, right? It asks for a reason. Pregunta por una razón. Why? And finally, we have how. Como. 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 Can you give me an example using how? How oh, about you? Okay, excellent. How about you? That is a nice question. How about you? Any other example? How are you? Okay, how are you? Now let's uh, complete these sentences using this WH word. What, who, where, when, and how. So let's start the first one. First one. Who? 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 Who is that Are person sure? over there? Who? Okay. Let's write it here. Who? And the next one. What? What? What, what is your last name? Okay. What is the meaning of this question? If I ask you this question, what? What is your last name? How? How? How are you? How? Um, okay. How? Very good. Oh, how? How do you spell your okay. last name? Who are you? Where are you from? Where are you from? Where are you from? Thank you. The next one is where? Where are you from? And the last one. When, when, is, when is your birthday? When is your birthday? Thank you. Now let's see. The second one. What is your last name? Any volunteer to answer this question? What yeah, is your last name? Okay, Emerita, tell me the answer. My last name is Elias. Okay, excellent. Thank you. That is the right answer. Your last name, su apellido. What is your last name? And how are you? Any volunteer to answer this question? How are you? I am fine. I'm fine, thanks. I'm fine. 
Okay. okay, I find things. Very good. Where are you from? Any volunteer? I'm like from you? San Salvador. Okay, I'm from San Salvador. And the next one. When is your birthday? Any volunteer to answer this question? When is my your birthday? My birthday is June. 14. My birthday is in June. Okay. Yes. Oh, my birthday is on June 14. My birthday is. Okay. Now pay attention to this question. How are you? Tonight we are going to learn about this, right? So let's go with the next. Very good job in this part. Any volunteer to read this question before to go to the next exercise? Any volunteer to practice reading these questions? Me, teacher. Emerita. Thank you, Merita. Number one. Who is that person over there? What Number is your three. last name? Number three. How are you? The next one. Where are you from? When is your birthday? Okay, that was excellent. Thank you. When is your birthday? Perfect. Thank you very much. Okay, let me take it out. And let's go with the next slide. Okay, let's see. We can use this question of conversation start is using W's word uh, to start a conversation, right? Uh, or to keep go in a conversation. Let's see, for example, number one, how old are you? How old are you? What is the meaning of this question? ¿Cuántos años? ¿Cuántos años okay. Very good. Let's see the next one. What is your favorite subject? ¿Cuál es tu materia English. Okay. What is your favorite subject? My favorite subject is English. Very good. Ya pasó en Merita. And who is your best friend? Who is your best friend? What is the meaning of this question? Who is your best friend? ¿Quién es tu mejor amiga? Okay, it could be your best, uh, your best friend. My yes, best my friend, friend is amigo. When is your English class? When is your English class? Oh, Friday. Okay. Okay. It's okay. It's from Monday to Thursday. Thursday. Okay. Yes. Remember that only this week we are going to have classes on Friday. The next week we are going to have classes from Monday. Monday to, to Thursday. Thursday. Uh, the next one, what is your favorite food? What is your favorite food? Seafood. Oh, seafood is your favorite food, okay. My favorite food is... Okay, food. very good. So you say crab, fish, uh, crab. octopus, shrimps, shells. Okay. Uh, what are you from in the next one? Where are you from? I am from El Salvador. Ah, that is an easy one. So let's start making some question. The first one. How old are you? Let's see. Let's choose someone. How old are you, Jose Luis? How old are you? Jose Luis? I am 40 years old. Thank you very much. Uh, let's see. Florcita, how old are you? Very good. Okay, that is a good answer. But for another equation, right? How are you? In this case, how old are you? ¿Cuántos años tiene? How old are you? Uh, okay, I I have till twenty nine. Twenty nine years old. Years old. Twenty nine years old. And the last one. Let's see, Brian and Steve. How old are you? I oh, yeah, am 22 years old. Okay, excellent answer. Thank you. The next question, what is your favorite subject, Daisy Carolina? What is your favorite subject? My favorite subject is English. 
Thank you. Margarita Lizette, what is your favorite subject? My favorite subject is Marimas. Okay, Marimaric. Okay. Marimaric. You like numbers a lot. Uh, let's see, Adriana Guerra, what is your favorite subject? Language. Oh, language. My language. favorite language. 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 language or literature. Literatura, right? Literature. And literature. let's go with the next one. Carmen Diaz, uh, who is your best friend? Uh, um, my best friend is Juanita. Okay, excellent answer. Thank you. Uh, Ronald Antonio Luna, who is your best friend? My best friend is, is the Carol. Okay, excellent. Rocio, who is your best friend? Hello, Rocio. Good evening. My best friend. Yes, good evening. <laughs> My best friend is Carolina. Carolina, okay, thank you. But is Daisy Carolina or another Carolina? Another, another. Carolina. <laughs> ah, okay. Now let's see, when is your English class? Ingrid eh, Delmira, when is your English class? You say, my English class is on Tuesday, on Wednesday. When is your English class? Let's go with the next one. What is your favorite food? Let's go with Adriana Guerra. What is your favorite food? Hello, Adriana, good evening. Okay, then let's go with it is Adriana. Good evening. Is, hello, good evening. What is your favorite food, Adriana? Eh, ¿Cuándo es la clase de inglés, verdad? The last one. Sorry, the next one. What is your favorite food? Mm. Um. My favorite food is... Pusos. And you say the name of the food, right? My favorite food is lasagna. My favorite food is pizza. My favorite food is rice and beans with cheese. Mm. My favorite is uh, pizza. Okay, excellent. My favorite food is pizza. And what about you, Julia? How about you? What is your favorite food? My favorite food is spaghetti with cheese. Ah, okay, that is delicious. delicious. I like spaghetti and cheese. Me and too. Sara, Sara Guzman, what is your favorite food? My favorite food is cheese. Cheese, okay. Or the cheese. Mm -hmm. oh, you say onions and cheese? No. Oh. Or, o sea, todo lo que tenga queso. Ah, okay. Everything mm -hmm. with or cheese. cheese. It's okay for mm -hmm. you. Ah, okay. Interesting. And the last one, where are you from? You say, I'm from El Salvador. So we can use these questions to keep a conversation going, right? Puede utilizar estas preguntas para que vaya fluyendo la conversación, ¿verdad? Eh, con alguien que acaba de conocer. ¿no? What is your favorite subject? Who is your best friend? When is your English class? What is your favorite food? Uh, where are you from? Where do you live? Donde vives? So we can use these, these questions. Then let's go with this. Uh, we're going to practice this conversation and we are going to focus on this one. How is it going? Ya han escuchado esa pregunta? How is it going? How is it going? Yes. Yes. 
Do you know the meaning of this question? How is it going? ¿Cómo te va? ¿Cómo estás? ¿Cómo estás? ¿Cómo te va? Okay, it's similar to us. How are you, right? It's another way to say, how are you? Uh, look at this conversation between Sam, he and David. And Sam, he say, hey, David, how is it going? Fine, things. How are you? Pretty good. So are your classes interesting this semester? Yes, they are. I really love chemistry. Chemistry are Chemistry, are you and Beth in the same class? No, we aren't. My class is in the morning. Her class is in the afternoon. Listen, I own my way to the cafeteria. Now, are you free? Sure, let's go. Now, look at this question. How is it going? What is a good answer for this question? Fine, thanks. Fine, thanks. Fine, thanks. Then this no, is, how, are how are you? How are you? Pretty good. Muy bien. So are your classes interesting this semester? Yes, they are. I really love chemistry. Chemistry, are you in the same class? No, we aren't. My class is in the morning. Her class is in the afternoon. And then to finish this conversation, so listen, I am on my way to the cafeteria now. Voy de camino a la cafetería. Are you free? ¿Estás sure. libre? ¿Estás desocupado? Sure, let's claro. go. Claro, vamos. ¿no? Vamos. So, do you have any question about new vocabulary in this small conversation? Do you have any question? A word okay, that sure. you don't know the meaning? I'm... No, everything is okay? No, it's okay. Okay. Let's Teacher. focus on this question. Yes? Teacher, eh, pronuncien de nueva, nuevamente eh, ahí donde está la respuesta de David. Donde dice, yes, they are. I really love eh, esa palabra. Mm, which eh, one? Eh, no, arriba, 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 arriba. Yes, <coughs> they are, dice. I really love. Chemistry. 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 Yes, chemistry. I really love chemistry. Thank you for your question. Any other question? No questions? Okay. Then let's go with the next. Pay attention to this phrase. How is it going? There are other ways to ask it. How's going on, for example? How's going on? It's como, como van las cosas? ¿Qué está sucediendo? How's going on? So a good answer for this question is nothing, not much. Instead of using a, every time that we a, greet someone, instead of using just, how are you? We can use this other option. How's going? How it's going on? What's new? What's up? How have you been? Or how is it going? How is it going? We can use these phrases, right? And we are going to sound more natural when speaking English when we use them, right? Some of things are informal, right? But they are very used when speaking in English with other people. So how it's going on? What's new? What's up? How have you been? And how is it going? How to answer this question, right? When someone asks you, how are you? We, we normally say, I'm fine, thank you. And you? So it's kind of mechanical, right? You sound like mechanical, right? A robot when you answer in that way. So we can use these other phrases, right? To increase our vocabulary, to sound more natural, so... The next time you are going to ask someone, how are you? Remember this right? and try one of these phrases. In lugar de decir, how are you? You can use one of these phrases. Right? So how's going on? What's new? What's up? How have you been? How is it going? Y todas ellas, ¿verdad? Son similares preguntando, ¿cómo está? ¿Cómo van las cosas? ¿Cómo has estado? 
So for the equation, how it's going on, we can use nothing or not much. What's new? You can use the same answer, right? Nothing, not much. What's up? Eh, ¿Qué ha pasado? ¿Qué ha sucedido? Uh, nothing, not much. How have you been? I'm good. I've been good. I've been all right. Pretty good. And you? So we can use this answer when someone asks this. How have you been? ¿Cómo has estado? Yo, I'm good. I've been good. Yo he estado bien. I've been all right. Todo ha estado bien. Pretty good. And you? Muy bien. ¿Y tú? So how is it going? Right? The equation in the conversation. It's going great. It's going well. No bad. Could be better. We can use this answer for this question. How is it going? How is it going? It's going great. It's going well. No bad. Could be better. So do you have any question about these phrases? Question? Do you have a question? Okay, let's practice then. I need two volunteers in this part. Who wants to participate? Two volunteers, please. Help me, help me. Any volunteer tonight? Who wants to participate? Yo tengo una teacher. Uh, tell me, Margarita, what is your question? Hi, teacher. Hello, Carmen. Tell me. Tengo una inquietud. Okay. Una curiosidad. Es que veo allí en la cuestión donde dice eh, pretty good in you. Pretty eh, en el entendido que es bonito, ¿verdad? Y good oh. es bueno. Ok, pretty. Pretty good. Tiene eh, varios significados. ¿verdad? En este caso, pretty como adjetivo significa bonito, chévere, lindo. So that is the meaning of pretty. But también como adverbio significa bastante. Bastante, bien, muy bien. So en este caso, pretty good lo traduciríamos como bastante bien. Okay. Okay. How have you been? ¿Cómo has estado? Pretty good. Bastante Pretty. bien. And you? Bastante bien. So, así lo traduciríamos en este contexto. ¿verdad? Ok. Thank you. Ok. Any other question? Any other question? No more questions? Teacher, I no have a question. question. Oh. Tell me, Emily, what is your question? Eh, ¿Qué significa eh, bien? Bien. This is the past participle of the verb be. Es el mismo verbo to be. Solo que está como pasado participio. So, estado. ¿Cómo has estado tú? Bien. Es el past participle del verb be en esta oración. Is it clear now? Yes, teacher. Thanks. Okay, excellent. Any other question? Okay, no more question then. Who wants to practice? Any volunteer? Any volunteer to practice in this? Remember the phrases, how's going on, what's new, what's up, how have you been, how is it going? Me, teacher. Thank Carmen. you, Carmen. Carmen, any other volunteer? Okay. Me too, teacher. Oh. Okay, Carmen and Luis. Okay, Carmen, can you choose one of these phrases to ask uh, Luis? ¿Cómo está él el día de hoy? Eh, perdón, ¿quién inicia? Ah, you. you, Carmen. You. De aquí en how, how, how have you been? 
Okay, but uh, let's do it right and uh, let's practice more, right? It's like, for, hello, good evening, Luis. <laughs> hello, good evening, Luis. Good evening, how, Carmen. How have you been? How have you been? I am good. And you? Pretty good. Okay, mm -hmm. excellent. Pretty good. Okay, very good. Thank you. Any other volunteers to practice? Thank you, Carmen. Thank you, Luis. You did a great job in this part. Thanks mm -hmm. a lot. Any other volunteer to practice? Me, teacher, Erika. Thank you, Alejandra. And any other volunteer? Thank you, Emerita. So, Alejandra, can you please start? Say, hello, Emerita, good evening. And okay. then you ask the question. Hello, Emerita, good evening. How have you been? I'm good. I'm being good. Okay, excellent. Okay. And, and you, right? We can use en you para devolver la pregunta. ¿Y tú? ¿Qué tal? En you. And you? Oh, I am good. I am good. Okay, excellent. Okay, solo decirles algo, ¿verdad? Acá me faltó darle un enter, porque es diferente. You say just I'm good o I've been good. Right? Son dos respuestas separadas. I'm sorry for that. Right? So I'm good. I've been good. No es toda la frase, ¿verdad? Son es separado acá. I'm good, or puede decir, I've been good. Any question with this? No questions? Oh, no question. Okay. No question. Yes, what is your question? What does it mean? Where it says, después de la respuesta que diciendo, I've been good, la siguiente, I've been I've been arrived. Uh, he estado bien. Todo ha estado bien. All right. Okay, muchas gracias. Okay, all right is bien, correctamente, without problems, sin problemas. I've been right. He estado bien. Any other question? No, teacher. No more question. Okay, very good. No Let's see this. It's okay. Uh, okay, when someone asks you, how are you? Generalmente su respuesta es esta, right? Am I right or no? I'm fine. Thank you. Fine. Yes or not? Yes. 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 Okay, so we need to Thank increase you. our vocabulary, yeah. right? We need to learn another phrase, right? And this is your chance. Instead of saying, I'm fine, thank you, you can use these phrases. I'm good, pretty good, I'm well. So the, last, the next time that someone asks you, how are you? Then you say, I'm good, or pretty good, or I'm well, okay? Never more say, I'm fine, right? Nunca más diga, I'm fine. Try another phrases, right? Intente con otras frases. I'm good, pretty good, I'm well. And sometimes we use this, right? Instead of saying so, so, which means más o menos, right? Then you say, how are you? You say, so, so, right? Eh, in the school, it's okay, right? Porque era una de las respuestas más fáciles, ¿verdad? Solo digo so, so, y el teacher ya no me pregunta. So, it's okay. <laughs> But now that we are learning this uh, language and we want to learn a little bit more. So we need to use another phrases. So instead of saying so, so say, I'm okay. I'm okay, not too bad. Not tan mal, but estoy bien, not tan mal. All right, todo está bien. O podemos ser sarcásticos, ¿verdad? También podemos utilizar el sarcasmo en inglés. For example, I'm alive. I'm alive. How are you? I'm alive. No estoy muy bien, pero todavía estoy vivo. I'm alive. <laughs> so we can use these phrases, right? So remember this, I'm good, 
pretty good. I'm well, I'm okay, not too bad. All right, I'm alive. So don't forget about this, right? So try to say one of these phrases the next time that someone asks you, how are you? And forget it a little bit about I'm fine, thank you. So you can use one of these phrases. So we are going to have a practice right now. We are going to use some of the phrases that we have already learned tonight uh, to practice with your classmate, right? We are going to use these phrases, how it's going, what's new, what's up, how have you been, how is it going, and also the equation, this equation, this one. For example, like, hi, Luis, good evening. How good is evening, it going? teacher. How is it going? I'm good. Okay, okay, Luis, uh, can you tell me what is your favorite subject? <clears throat> Excuse me, uh, mathematics. Oh, very yes. interesting, uh, Luis, who is your best friend? Uh, my best friend uh, is my father. My oh, it's your father. oh, that's very yes. good. So tell me, Luis, what is your favorite food? My favorite food is seafood. I like seafood. Ah, yes. uh, I also like seafood, especially fish. fish. And where are you from, and Luis? I'm from to Chalatenango. Ah, that City. is a beautiful place. That is a beautiful yes. place. And it's near to Lake uh, um, Suchitlan. Ah, okay, Suchitlan Lake. Yes. That is a beautiful place in El Salvador, right? It's very yes. touristic. And Luis, can you tell me how old are you? Um, I have a 66 years old. Oh, 66 years yes. old. Okay. That's Too young. Good, Too young. Yes, you are young. <laughs> you are very young too, right? Thank you, teacher. Okay. So as you can see, we can use this, right? To, to keep a conversation, right? With someone. So we are going to try to do this and practicing. So are you ready? Yes. I yes. Uh, you can yes. copy one of these, right? One of these phrases. And you are going to have a conversation with your classmate. Okay. Is it, is it clear in the activity? Yes? Yes, teacher. It's clear. Okay. Nice. Do you have time to copy these questions? I can give you... I can give you time, right? One or two minutes. Do you need them? Let me know when you are ready, please. You send by WhatsApp, teacher? Oh, let's see. Oh, I can take a picture and send you to WhatsApp. Give me a second. Okay, for you to have in the group. Yes, give me a second. In the group, okay. Okay. Okay, now the question are on the WhatsApp group. Is it okay for you? Can we start? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes. Here we go. You can ask this question, question and answer with your classmate. So tonight we are going 20. We are going to make group of three. Okay, you are going to have five minutes. You are going to have five minutes to complete this activity. So try to practice with your classmate, right? Try to um, ask and answer as many questions as you can. So see you in five minutes, guys. Here we go. Okay.
is Matt. Okay. Who is your best friend? Oh, my best friend is Rolando. When is your English class? It's from Monday to Thursday. Okay. What is your favorite food? My favorite food is hamburger, for example. Okay. Where are you from? I am from uh, San Salvador, El Salvador. Okay. Eh, las frases de abajo también, ¿verdad? Yes, sí, okay. sí, I can practice. Bye. How have you been? I am good. I've been good. Okay. How it going? Uh, not bad. Okay. Okay. Ahora con Julia. Okay. Le pregunto. Sí, o si Julia quiere este, preguntar. What is your favorite food? Oh. What? What is your favorite mm. food? Uh, oh, my favorite food is Chinese food. And you guys say, what is your favorite food? It's uh, fish. Emily? Yes. What is your favorite subject? Subject. My favorite subject is it's English. Okay. Where are you from? I'm from El Salvador. Okay. Sí. <laughs> okay. Entonces, Flor, uh, can you tell me when is your English class? Um, next class is Monday. Two, um, two, 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 Thursday. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Ingrid, tenemos que practicar nosotros. Sí, que ustedes. sí, ok. Ok, hello Ingrid. Hello. Eh, what's your name? Su nombre, Ingrid Elmira. My name is Ingrid Elmira. My name is Ingrid Serna. Uh, uh, yes. Carmen, uh, Ingrid. Okay, nice, nice to meet you. How old are you? How old are you? Um, I am 24 years old. And you? Um, I'm, I am uh, 50, 52 years old. Uh, uh, what's your favorite subject? Mm. Okay. Did you finish? Yes. Yes? Yes, I finished, teacher. Okay. So, hello. Good evening, Rocio. How is it going? Good evening. I'm not bad. Okay. Uh, Rocio, can you tell me who is your best friend? My best friend is Kenya. Oh, very nice. Uh, how old are you, Rocio? I'm 21 years old. 
Okay, very good. And I want to know about Adriana Guerra. Good evening. How are you, Adriana? I am 20. Oh, okay. And how are you tonight, Adriana? How are you? How do you feel tonight? All right. How is it going? Or how have you been? Um, how are you? Um, so pretty good. Uh, I'm very well. Uh, um, um, very well. Okay. Thank you, Adriana. Adriana, can you tell me what is your favorite subject? What's your favorite subject, Adriana? Uh, I am a language. 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 Okay. Language. Excellent. And what about you, Luis? What is your favorite subject? Mathematics, teacher. Mathematics. Interesting. Yes, you are an engineer, like. right? You are an engineer. Um, no, I am a marketing. Ah, okay. And administration. Okay, marketing and administration, nice. And Rocio, what is your favorite subject? Mm, my favorite subject is history. History, okay, very interesting, right? And where are you from, Rocio? I'm from San Salvador. Soyapango. Ah, Soyapango, okay. <laughs> yes. Mm, How yes. do you live in Soyapango? Okay. Very nice. Thank you, guys. See you in a minute with the rest of your classmates. Thank you. You did a great job. Thanks a lot. Thank you, teacher. Hey, hello, hello. Welcome to the class. How was your practice? Did you finish? Yes. Yes, I couldn't believe all of you. My dad's son of you, and you were doing a very nice job. So do you have any questions about the activity? Any question? Was it good? Was it bad? Good. It was good. Very good. good. Okay, that was very good. Nice. Um, just to finish the class, we are going to see this. This. Eh, las preguntas que estuvimos practicando son preguntas de información, verdad? Information question. So, what is your name? So you have to give information. What is your last name? Where are you from? Eh, where do you live? Eh, who is your favorite friend? Oh, sorry. Who is your best friend? What is your favorite subject? What is your favorite food? So you get the information. Now in the yes, no questions, we are going to answer with short answer. And we just have two options. In este tipo de preguntas, solo tenemos dos opciones. You say yes or not. So in Spanish, we call them pregunta cerrada. Usted solo dice sí, no. So in English, you know the same. So yes, no with the verb to be. Look at this example. Are you free? Are you free? Uh, let's see. Are you free tonight? Está libre esta noche after class? Are you free? Yes, I am. Okay. <laughs> yes, I am. Yo estoy libre, ¿verdad? No tengo nada que hacer después. So you say, yes, I am, or no, I'm not. No, I'm not. Okay. okay, so it's David from Mexico. To answer, yes, he is. No, he's not. Or no, he isn't. So we have two options to make a contraction in this. We can say he is not or no, he isn't. No, he isn't. So it's bed class in the morning. 
Yes, it is. No, it's not. Or no, it isn't. Are you and Beth in the same class? Yes, we are. No, we're not. Or no, we aren't. Are your classes interesting? Yes, they are. Or no, they are not. No, they aren't. So let's practice. Any volunteer to answer the first question? Are you free? I'm going to choose some. Let me see who. Uh, Ruth, Emilia, are you free tonight? Uh, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. Okay, excellent. Very good. So let's see. Oscar, are you free tonight? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Okay, ya tienen compromiso, ¿verdad? Ya tienen algo que hacer después de clase. ¿no? Los trastes los están esperando. Sleep. <laughs> yeah. Eh, <laughs> oh, Luis, are más you clases. Free? Más clases, really? <laughs> the platform teacher, no, the platform, I, you say. I have to work on the platform. The classmate teacher. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now let's see. Is David from Mexico? Can you yes, he is. Yes, he is. Is bad class in the morning? No. Yes, it is. Oh, yes, it is. Oh, is your class in the morning? Is your English class in the morning? No, it is not. Okay, no, no, it is not. Or no, it isn't. No, it's not. Or no, it isn't. You have it to isn't. open. Yes. Okay. So, are you Oscar and Luis in the same class? Yes. Yes, we, we are. are. Yeah. Yes, we, we are. are. Yes, we, we are. are. Okay, now let's see, are your classes interesting? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. yes. They, are. they are. Very interesting. Okay. okay, keep in mind this answer. We're going to solve the next exercise. This is the last exercise for tonight. And let's practice. Who wants to answer the first one? Are you happy? Yes. 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 I am. Yes. Okay. yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Now let's see. Is the dog in the garden? Is your dog in the garden? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Okay. How do you say yo no tengo un perro in English? I don't have a dog. Okay, I don't have a dog. Very good. Now let's see. Is he a teacher? Let's see, yes, is, is, is Oscar yes. a teacher? Yes, he is. No, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he okay, is. Oscar, are you a teacher? No. No. He's not. Oh, he's not. He, he okay. isn't. Oh, he's, okay, no, no, no he's he not. No, no he's not. not. Okay, excellent. Uh, are your parents from Italy? No. Are your parents no. from Italy? No, I am no. not. No, no they, they are not. not. Oh, we are not. talking about they. Are your they parents are. from Italy? No, they aren't. No, they aren't. No, they aren't. Am I your friend? Am I your friend? Yes, you are. Yes. Ah, thank you, Luis. Am I your friend? <laughs> Yes, you yes. are. Yes, you are. Yes, my friend. Yes. It's like, soy yo su amigo? Am I your friend? Uh -huh. yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yes, you are. Of right? course. <laughs> no, you aren't. No, you aren't. Sorry. <laughs> no, you aren't. My friend. Uh, so, um, yes, no question, right? We answer yes or not in this type of question. So you are going to find some exercise about this on the platform and also about the WH word questions. If you have any question, feel free to write on the WhatsApp group. Take a, a screenshot, tome una captura de pantalla and send to the WhatsApp group and say, I have a problem with this exercise. Can you help me please? And then you say, and I'm going to be happy to help you. So don't forget about that, friend.
El grupo de WhatsApp también lo podemos utilizar para eso. Si usted tiene alguna pregunta, algún problema con algún ejercicio en la plataforma, eh, escriba, ¿verdad? Escriba. Si yo no puedo ayudarle, entre nosotros podemos ayudarnos, ¿verdad? Recuerde que somos un grupo y estamos trabajando juntos por ese diploma, ¿verdad? Si alguien ya resolvió ese ejercicio y puede ayudarle en ese momento al compañero que tiene la duda, do it, right? Feel free to do it, right? So, eh, right, right in the WhatsApp group if you have a question. So, thank you very much for your attention, for your participation. You did a great job during this class. Thanks a lot. I really appreciate your participation and your help. Thank you very much. So enjoy Thank your you weekend. Teacher. And the next class is on Monday right, at 8 p.m. Don't forget about that. And please, right? Keep working okay, on the classroom exercises and evaluations. If you can come, if you okay. can complete the platform during this weekend, it's okay, right? You can do it without any problem. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Have a nice weekend. Okay, teacher. teacher. Have a nice okay, weekend. Teacher. Enjoy your weekend. See you on Monday. Okay. Bye bye, guys. And God bless you. Bye bye. Good night. 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 Good night.